Mba, stay close to your mother to look after her. Mba, now your mother has another stroke. Jesus. You are busy in Abuja doing what not. They say the surgery is in Abuja or Dubai. God, what am I even stabbing you when all this whole bad things keep happening to me? Yeah. I'm going to lose my mother. God, why? God, why speak to me now? Susa! I have to cut him. I will sell my gold. Thank you. Tay. But your gold is in Port Harcourt. Hmm? And my mother is dying. I have no choice. Eh, but you don't have to sleep with him afterwards. What? I'm very... Uh -huh. What's that for? <laughs> because you know, what did you take me for? I know you too well, Susan. No, because you can get overly indebted to failures. Well, that's old Susan. Hmm. Old Susan, new Susan. We'll see. For now, let's just see your mom and call him. Good Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Call him. Stop crying. God, you are alive. You are watching. Okay. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Okay, um, where are we? Chocolate. My mother. Yes, my mother. Calm down, calm down. What your stroke? <laughs> Sorry, I'm sorry to hear that. What can I do? Don't Tea. And why are you drinking tea in the first place? You've always been a coffee person. She called it a taste board vacation. You and your tummy. Remind me never to fall in love. Oh, you mean never to fall in love again? Well, Timmy, Larry. <laughs> no, I don't. But I do want my stony UK ears back. Well, you have to ask your mother for that one, not me. She was one who forcefully and cruelly recruited us back to Nigeria. <laughs> and what was she supposed to do? Allow her 14-year-old daughter run off with a teenage Romanian boyfriend to Southeastern Europe? I wasn't wrong enough! Oh. <laughs> you paid for hotel accommodation in Poland with dad's credit card, mm. bought train tickets, and then paid for a honeymoon vacation in Belarus. Tell Don't me again, what was she supposed to do? talk about it! If I start now, you say my people have come. Ah, oh, my bad. Please, revoke your people's visa. <sighs> Anyways, you know, it's kind of funny how a man alters his whole life for a woman, and then she still thinks that I'm not totally committed to her. The things we do for love. She doesn't think you're not committed. She worries that your mother 
We'll make her marriage and live in hell. Or worse. <laughs> what do you mean, or worse? <laughs> you think mom might physically abuse her? <laughs> Have you met your mother? No, but... I think she does have a valid reason to worry. Mm -hmm. Now her worry has become my worry. I heard! <laughs> you heard what? You know! No, I don't know! Your karma, Kasi? See. Is anything private in this family? Please don't blame me. You were the one who decided to give Mumsy a piece of your well articulated mind. Coincidentally, I was talking with Popsy when it happened, and he happened to be with Mumsy when she threatened harm on your children. Naturally asked him what's going on, asked him why, and the rest was just natural father-daughter juicy gossip. This is irregular! <laughs> I don't think there's quite the adjective to describe how irregular the situation is. What did you... Oh, the boy, come in! That's what I'm saying, just... It is me in the world. Karuma. Where is she? Where is she? Okay. Where, where is Uma? That husband snatching, god forsaken, gold digging scallywag that I hear you want to marry. You war after impregnating my daughter. I, I, Timmy! I, 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 you're no longer a virgin? Shut up. This is news. I, I, I didn't do. You, that, 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 that song. You didn't what? You totally took advantage of. My virgin daughter, you got her pregnant, then all of a sudden, you are a stammerer. Ah, Timmy, if it wasn't for my daughter, I would have had you castrated. Ah, mommy, one can feel more body, yeah? Will you shut your dirty mouth? Oh yeah, your friend is in the car. Go and meet her and let me interrogate this, this rapist. Mr. Rapist, I'll be downstairs with her. You look like no. Ma, I must respectfully state that I did not rape your daughter. In fact, I don't remember any immorality with, with being paid. Ah, uh ah, -uh. you won't remember now. Oh, so now she is suddenly immoral and totally forgettable, isn't it? Eh? No, I, I, I didn't say that, Ma. You didn't say that? Then what are you saying? Uh, what are you saying to me? Are you trying to say that I, Her Excellency, Chief Mrs. Fat Baby for Lauren Shaw the first. The first first lady of our glorious state is a liar. Is that it? No, ma. Better for you. But, but ma, you never told me she was pregnant. Oh, eh? How would she tell you? Eh? My poor, sweet and innocent baby. She was totally traumatized after the incident that she hid it from even me, her beloved mother. After I found out, I had to send her off to Sweden just to cover up the embarrassment. Now, you will join her today. She will have a secret wedding, which will be leaked to the press as a beautiful and loving private affair between the wonderful couple. But, I mean, mm. I can't just travel just like that. I mean, I have work. Work. <laughs> The same work that I got for you in my friend's company. Yes, ma'am. Ah. Very well then. I have told him already that you would need two weeks off for your wedding with my daughter. He sends his congratulations and promises a very great wedding gift. This is, this is irregular. This is highly desperately irregular. Not nearly as irregular as your life will be if you are not on that plane to Sweden tonight. Hey, never mind. So just give me a chance to go through it in the morning then. Um, yeah, yeah, I agree. But no, we have to do something about that. The percentage is not that up. They don't work for me, they wouldn't work for my friends. Okay, no problem. So we'll speak then. Oh, come on now. Yeah, but I just got back from Paris, you know that. I'm not in the mood to travel. Come on, uh, uh, come on, it's not... Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, see who play. Okay, fine. So we'll talk later.
We'll talk later. <laughs> it's okay. Just, just give me some time. All right, thank you. I, I have someone I have to... Yeah, yeah. Yes, in the morning. <sighs> you know I'm an early bird. You can call me from seven. <laughs> I, you, <laughs> I will, but you know it's not fair. I just came back from Paris and you want me to travel again. Honestly, honestly, it's not fair. It's not the best thing I could have asked for. But listen, this is business. We all give sacrifices for the life and the things that we want. Okay. Yes, seven, eight, bye. All right. Chocolate. How are you holding up? I just don't know. I, I don't know what I will have done. If you, I, I... It's okay. It was nothing really. Hmm? I mean, how could I have known someone with a private jet? My mother, I would have just, I would have just lost my... Don't say that. Don't say that. My friend was just uh, in the States to see the governor and he had his private jet with him, so that's fine. It's nothing really. Hold me a favor. You won't lose her. On the brighter side, your uncle traveled with them. He was quite delighted. My uncle? That wicked man! Ooh. Listen, listen, I gave him a thousand dollars for his spending money. Yeah, I'm sure he would. Never hear from him again. You don't understand. My uncle is very, very, very wicked. You should have let him. Oh, hey. Chocolate. <laughs> My dear, there are some enemies that you conquer and some others that are inevitable. You convert them to your side so that you can use them. Trust me, after his first intercontinental flight on a private jet and his first night in an all expense paid five star hotel in Dubai. He'll call you auntie when he comes back. <laughs> <laughs> That's more like it. A smile becomes you. Thank you for being there. That's the least I can do. I'm your knight in shining armor. Your personal knight in shining armor. I should sure feel like a princess. And you haven't felt the half of it yet. Come in. Uh, Meet on Amazon Street. Amazon Street. 700 Naira. Sister, put your seatbelt for me. Via you and road safety. <laughs> very good, very good. <laughs> just, just put that there. <laughs> just wind up. You made a nose your bag. <laughs> that's right, that's right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I said Amazon Street and I said 700 Naira. Kilo wants, why are you crying now? <laughs> if I talk now, <laughs> I know blue God know which one this one uncle will be. Eh? Oh. Now you make I don't tell. Now you make I don't tell you have to say every Thursday now for praying and fasting. All this early morning touchy body, you know go, did they bring bad bad luck? See all the kind passengers why don't they carry since money? You lady in Sukwisi. You know, very cool. Eh? Amazon Street look below. And they pay 700 naira. <sighs> Sister, what's it happen? It's my dog. Ah. Hello? Did the dog die? In? No! Why would you say something like that? Why would you say such a wicked thing? Ah, sorry. Oh my god, no! I, I, I should have cried. I think say boy, you're the dog down. No, she didn't die. Oh my god, if she died, I would be inconsolable. Oh my god. Inconsolable? Pinky dead? I can't even think of it. What, what would I do? 
Oh my god, what would I ever do if she were dead? Oh, I can't even, oh my god. Sorry, sister, sister, so sorry, sorry, no vex, no vex, no vex. Hey, but what you come do the dog now? She doesn't love me anymore. Oh, no, my dear. Don't you like what? You didn't defend the dog? No. Why would you ask such a stupid question? No oh, vex. I don't call no again. Okay, well, me and Nasiru, when, before Nasiru came into my life, now she just follows him everywhere. Nasiru. Nasiru not a person. I've been a dog too. No, silly. Nasiru's not a dog's name. Nasiru's a person's name. Ah, Emma Bino. Ah, Do you know a dog named Nasiru? Ah, Emma Bino. Emma Bino. Nasiru. Doggy. Aja. You know, you're, you're not being really helpful. You're being uh, awfully mean and quite unsympathetic. See, sorry. If, if Nasiru liked the dog and the dog liked Nasiru, I mean, what is the problem there? Okay, well, I'll tell you. So, me and Nasiru have been seen for a couple of weeks now, and she just follows him around. Like, I don't know what I did. I, I, I must have traumatized the dog. Like, like, I don't know. I must have been a bad parent, you know? That's why she doesn't love me anymore. Oh my god. If if I can't take care of a dog, then then how can I how can I take care of a human being? How can I have children of my own? Oh my god, I'm a bad mom! My children are gonna grow up to hate me. They're gonna resent me. I'm a bad mom. I'm a bad mom. That's why she doesn't ah, love me anymore. Aja, asa, asa. No one so cool for. Sister, you be like saying you did less busy. Hmm? Yes, because person when get work, eh? No go get chance for in brain to they think this kind of nonsense when you they think right now. What are you saying? And I said they see you so. You be like saying they no beat you well when you be small picking. Yes. No. Yes. Nobody beat me. Uh -huh. That's child okay. abuse. I call come. Child abuse, come. Child abuse me. As they not abuse you, so that's your life can be. <laughs> What's wrong with my life? Huh? God have mercy. Huh? God go punish all these rich people. Huh? And I said, they see so. The black said your papa money get hand inside this problem. You see, if to say you drink Gary. Or you chop Gary like the children they waiting for other places. You for no good time they think all these kind of things. Aja, doggy. Ah, kill me. Yeah. I, you, you know what? I think this now constitutes for a hostile environment. Please, drop it out or I'll be suing you. Money na 1,000. Bole. 1,000 naira. But you, but you said 700 naira. Tell any, eh? The extra 300. Now, for all the nonsense where I don't, where the cry cry and all the nonsense where my ear don't hear, you don't spoil my day. Huh? I don't just have it to work again. 1,000 naira, Bole, calm down. You're unbelievable. 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 1,000 naira. Pay your money. Take. I don't eh. want to be in your car, eh. anyways. Eh. Yeah. Now, see you. Aja. Eh. I want more. I want more. This thing is very simple. Eh? Castration. Trip to Sweden. Your choice. But Ma, me and yeah, Pinky don't even love each other. I mean, how can people get married just like that? Besides, I already told you, I have a fiance and she has done nothing wrong to me. Ah. So when you were busy taking my beloved daughter's virginity, did you remember love? Well, I didn't take her virginity. Hey, watch your words. You are not Korean. Watch your words very carefully. If you don't want to be deformed, Chamba. You know what? Let's be going. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You will buy clothes at the airport. Just pick your passport. And yes, your phones, so I can monitor your movement. Oh, yeah. Hey, Carol. Who are you supposed to be? His cleaner. 
I'm his fiancé. Oh, you are the Omo Jati Jati. Wolo Omo Rada Rada. Rede Rede. Omo Doti Omo Lele. You are the Omo Lele Lasso Lasso. The Omo Tio Nero. You are that husband snatching gold digger. Oh, please. Please, somebody get this filthy thing out of my sight before I murder someone's daughter. Fiancé. If that's how they get fiancé, even goats will have fiancé. To me, why am I being insulted in the house? And who is this woman who won't respect her age? Ah, being fair. Timmy, Timmy. So, this is the mannerless bastard that you want to leave my daughter for. Ah, well, eh, I swear. If you do not pick your passport and get moving right now, ah, you oh. can insult me. I don't care. But if you bring my parents into this, I will forget your age and show you how manless I can be. <laughs> Leave me, to meet. As I said, no home training. <laughs> but, <laughs> of course, what do I expect from a daughter of wayward commoners? Me. Timmy. <laughs> like the early morning yeah darling sweet darling you make me feel like superman yeah darling sweet darling your smile is like the early morning yeah 